A. Why did he just do that? Coast Community Church may never cease to amaze you. Coast Community Church may never cease to surprise you. Uh, you may find things like ramp horns. In fact, Elder Bob, can you can you can do that for us? Christian prayer book. I bought it in Jerusalem, in Israel. And I wear this when I'm consecrating people. Because it's a set apart moment, in a set apart, very specific uh, realm of time for a specific purpose. There are all other occasions that I'll wear this Christian prayer cloth, which is just a Christian version of a Jewish prayer cloth. Jewish prayer cloth, you've probably seen me wear at the Seder. And it's called a talit. Um, what you're about to experience is a holy experience. And the word holy means separate and set apart. And I'm going to ask uh, the pastors and the elders to join me on the platform at the moment, please. Mr. God, if you'll join us on the platform, please. You've heard what has been said about you. You've heard what has been described as your responsibilities. Before God, these people, you accept these responsibilities, and will you carry them out? Not to the best of your ability, but to the best of the power You as the body of Christ will accept Jason Goff as your new deacon at Coast Community Church. Will you symbolize this for a round of applause? Jason, saved by the blood of the Lamb, anointed by the Holy Spirit, dedicated to the kingdom of God. We, the body of Christ, acknowledge that you are a man after God's own heart. We acknowledge that you are a man that seeks the face of God. And we acknowledge that you are a man who wants to give your life to the service kingdom of God. We acknowledge that you desire to be of service in ministry and to help the ministry of God advance here at Coast Community Church. 
We ask God to give you all anointing, blessing, strength, power, wisdom, knowledge, and every good gift that you will need to carry out your responsibilities as diaconos in the life of Coast Community Church. And we, the body of Christ, affirm you. Holy Spirit, thank you for your presence in this room. Jesus, thank you for your presence in this room. Yahweh, God our Father, we thank you for your presence in this room. And now, by the laying on of my hands and the anointing with oil, we, the pastors, evangelists, apostles, and elders of this church, dedicate you consecrate you and set you apart in the office and the service of the diaconos, deacon in the life of the body of Coast Community Church. We ask God's full anointing, full blessing upon you. And may you take your authority to be the servant, the worshiper, the praiser of God, the helper, the minister that you were called to be. When you are weak, may you be strong. When you fall, may you get up again. When you become frustrated, may the Holy Spirit give you peace. When you do not understand, may the Holy Spirit give you clarity. When you do not have answers, may God give you knowledge. When you are tired, may God strengthen you in such a way that that tiredness flees your body. When you do not know which way to turn, may God make the path very bright and very straight that you should follow. And we, the body of Christ, dedicate ourselves making your job easier by helping you to help us be the people of God together that we are meant to be. We pray this in the name of God the Father, the name of Jesus Christ, our King and our Lord, and the name of Holy Spirit our anointer. Jesus, name above all names. The name at which someday, like Jason does right now, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ is Lord of Lords and King of Kings. And we highly exalt you tonight, King Jesus. Worthy is the Lamb. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Church, give Jesus a hand.